advice here. I cu- I'm currently in a three-way relationship with a male and a female partner since March, and we, we all f- share finances. Um, my female partner does nails, and I always had my nails done, so she started doing them. Come to find out, I'm looked down upon for not paying her for my services. My thoughts are this. Since we're sharing finances, I don't think it would even it would it would even be an issue because money is coming back into the group. Um, and two, I would personally never accept money from anyone I'm in a relationship with, especially if we're sharing finances. What do you guys think? So I, I don't know, obviously, how a three way relationship would work as far as sharing finances and, and then doing a situation like that. But I was like. I wanted to do Ronnie feel some kind of way because you do my nails and you do my lashes and you do them for free. Um, however, I do buy some lash products and I, I don't think I've bought any nail product. I, don't think. I think you did. Bought me a, you bought me a polish, I think. Oh, well, you know, so <laughs> I, I, I just figured since we're twins, like that's what I would do. But in, in the other hand, I'm like, also... Before you started doing my nails and my lashes, I wasn't going out getting my nails and lashes done. So that yeah. would probably be the difference if if I needed to pay you or not because I it's like I would be paying somebody else. So why not go and pay you? But I I wasn't already doing that stuff. I but with, with you, I use you as my my practice person. So and that's what it's always been. So I wouldn't expect for you to pay me for anything. Okay. Cause I I, I didn't I didn't know. I, was, I was like I wanted to do Ronnie really feel some kind of way but I don't I, I was like I, I don't, don't think even she, think about it yeah honestly. I was like I don't think she would I was like just like I give you steams and stuff but if you needed a steam of a product I didn't have I'm gonna be like yo I need you to order this you know this mm-hmm. joint which is actually still good just like if I if I order lash stuff or nail stuff for you you're not only using it on me you can use it on other clients as well mm-hmm. and that would be the same as you buying a herb for me. It's like I'm using it for you, but I can also use it for other people. So in the long run, it's still kind of saving you money in a sense right. or contributing to your business. Right. So, Or like if, you, if you're out and you see something like, ooh, she probably would like this. You can use this for her nails or she can use it for a steam or something right. like that. Then you get it or something like that. But I wouldn't, if I was in a three-way relationship, I wouldn't charge the other girl for doing her nails or her lashes or nothing like but that. But even if, even if you were out buying, even if she was out getting her nails done at $90 a pop, and then she coming you and you not getting nothing. Well, this is this is our household now, so I'm I'm still not gonna feel away now. Example with my friends who was talking about oh a full set only seventy dollars and then try to come to me and want me to do a nail so free, but you just paid that person seventy dollars. That's different. Mm-hmm. So I'm not gonna do that. You not you not giving me shit. You not even trying to tip me. I think I absolutely agree. I, if I was in a three-way relationship, I still wouldn't charge my people um, anything. Mm-hmm. Um, however, I would expect them to buy, like, buy some product. You know, mm-hmm. like I, I shouldn't have to foot. Like, if I if I'm running out of nails and I'm just like, oh, I gotta order nails before I get your nails done. I'm expecting you to be like, oh, I'll, well, I'll order, order them, them. Mm-hmm. right? Because you're getting your nails done as well. Mm-hmm. Um, but I'm also like. I feel what the girl's saying. Like, you know, mm-hmm. it's it's going back into the household anyway. But, I mean, I guess if you, like, 